Hi, I'm Michael Dougal. I appreciate you taking the time to watch this short message. The message really is three important questions you should ask of a listing agent before putting your home on the market with them. This way you can know exactly what to expect from that agent and just ensure you have a great selling experience. Every seller wants the same thing. They want the most amount of money in the time frame that works for them. There are, th there are certain things you can do to ensure that happens. Now, every agent will put the property on the MLS, the internet, maybe put a sign outside and send out some flyers, and it's all standard stuff. But question number one is what is the agent going to do above and beyond the norm to get the home sold? I'm going to give you a few examples of that. Now, for example, every seller wants a buyer. If you notice that we advertise our listings all, all across the internet if you've gone to my website, and that's all well and good, but I'm not talking about passive marketing where I'm just waiting there. I'm talking about how many buyers are they speaking to on a daily basis. Now, every day, and I've been doing this for years, I get on the phones at eight o'clock in the morning and I'm talking to potential buyers about the properties that I have listed. This is the type of marketing that sellers want. This is the type of marketing that I give my sellers, but many agents are unwilling to do, and it's just absolutely critical. So question number one is, what is the agent going to do above and beyond the norm? And under that is how many buyers are they speaking to on a daily basis? The second question you wanna ask is, have you sold homes in my neighborhood? The agent should be able to tell you about properties they've sold in your area. The reason this is important is for two reasons, because number one, it means that they'd be familiar with value, and number two, it means that they'd be very knowledgeable once they're speaking to an appraiser. They will be speaking to an appraiser after you have an offer accepted on your property, most likely. And the third question you should ask is, do you know where the buyers are right now? See, if the agent has sold listings in your area, then they are likely tracking the buyers. Now, we track every buyer who comes out to see any of our properties we have listed, and this can give our listings a tremendous advantage because once we put our properties on the market, we already know where to market it. We already know where the buyers are. Again, this can give you a tremendous advantage over the listings that you'd be competing with. I really hope this information was useful, and I would suggest that if you ask these three questions to myself or any agent you're interviewing, you'll have a great selling experience.